One of the Church of Scientology's most senior figures globally has been arrested and charged in Sydney. Jan Eastgate has been charged with perverting the course of justice. The charges relate to allegations she coached an 11-year-old girl to lie to police and community services about her sexual abuse. Those allegations were first aired on Late Line last year. Steve Kinane reports. Jan Eastgate is one of the most senior figures in the Church of Scientology. She is the international president of the Citizens Commission on Human Rights, an organisation that campaigns against psychiatry and was founded by the Church of Scientology. In 1988, she was awarded the Freedom Medal for promoting human rights. Now she is on bail in Sydney, charged with perverting the course of justice. Police allege Jan Eastgate threatened and intimidated Carmen Rayner when she was 11 years old into providing false statements to police about the sexual abuse she suffered from her stepfather. Carmen Rayner outlined these allegations for the first time on Late Line last year. Just say no. That she just kept repeating that. Just you remember that you can't tell them, don't say yes, because otherwise you will be taken away from your parents um, and you'll never see your family again. Um, because docs will take me and my brother away from my mum and that I needed to just say no. Carmen Rayner's story was backed up by her mother Phoebe. Jan Eastgate coached both of us actually. She and she was, she came to us with docs, they weren't called docs back then but she came with us to the interview and she basically told me what to say and Carmen what to say and she also told Carmen to lie to the police and I lied to the police as well because of that. Carmel Underwood, who was at the time a senior figure in Scientology, says she witnessed these events. I knew that Carmen was being coached on what to say to the Department of Community Services and to the police so I challenged them on that and we had a bit of an argument and um, I was told it was none of my business and to get out of there and I didn't want to get out of there because I wanted to stop what was going on, but I was escorted out of there. Jan Eastgate declined to be interviewed at the time these allegations first aired on Late Line. In an email to Late Line last year, she described the allegations by Carmen and Phoebe Rayner as egregiously false. She did not respond to an email sent by Late Line tonight. Jan Eastgate has been granted conditional bail and asked to surrender her passport. She is due to appear in Downing Centre Court on June 16. Steve Kinane, Late Line.